Gentlemen, I finally have a treadmill for my exercise. What a wonderful design these are. They've got all these little trays here for the Big Mac, for the shake, fries, even a little thing for the beer. Shall we test it? What I do like is if you drop your bits and pieces on it, magically takes them away, it just carries them away and they disappear. Because I'm a bit of a salad dodger. I have to confess, who wants fucking lettuce? Nobody wants that shit, do they? Where's my beer? It's even got a little thing there so you can catch up on all the fucking gossip. Now let's do some exercise, shall we? Here we go. Uh, I'll just pretend I'm on the way over the pub, look. But don't let me hold on just yet. Oh. Got, I can hold on if it gets really bad. Oh no, it's going to crash. I can't quite get my beer. Should we press this button here? Oh, actually, I actually quite like this. Mmm. <laughs> right, let's do something, shall we? What about this one? Oh, he's on his way. Look, he's running like the fucking pub's just going to shout. He's going to get his last fucking pint. <laughs> oh, he's banging into the sides. Oh, fuck me, that's hard work. I think this is hard work for me, gentlemen. So I have Harry here. He's a lot younger, a lot fitter, and he's going to have a go. I think he'd be able to outrun it. Let's go. Max, straight off the ball. Go on, then. He's getting cocky, look, no hands. Ain't gonna last for long. <laughs> I think he needs more. I can arrange that. Can we boys? Oh well, he's beat the machine. That's outrageous. Uh. <laughs> I think we need more. You want some more? I think more. This could be fun. I think we should uh, open it up carefully and have a look inside it. I've taken the liberty of opening the screws. Oh, look at that. That's a tasty DC motor. Permanent magnet. Crappy little PWM controller. Nothing to it, really. But the fact what I do like is, of course, the DC motor. So technically it can go backwards. You can see with the ratio on the belt there that it's actually stepped down. So the motor's going faster than the output. Ratio there is probably, I don't know, 5 to 1. Looks like an encoder at the back there so it knows how fast it's going. Naturally I think we'll remove that in a minute. Not much to it is there? I think we ought to try and use this motor as a dynamo. It will give us DC if we turn it, and if we rotate this belt, the motor will be geared up. So it will go quite fast, and we should have some sort of output. So we're going to get a lamp and connect it across that motor, and see how bright it goes. There's our halogen lamp connected directly across the motor. Now we give it a bit of work. Let's see if we can light that up. I think so. Free energy. See, it does exist. The only trouble is I have to put some McDonald's calories in to get an output. So, wasn't that efficient really, was it? 
Right, let's see if I can pop this bulb then, shall I? I think we shall. Oh, that's, oh, oh. that's too easy. Too easy. It suddenly got easier on the load. It was easier to sort of turn it. We're not going to worry about that silly electronic thing in there. We're going to use this. And this is our rectifier. Oh, there's a special little feature there. I wonder what that does. Oh, I just noticed that little code up there. Is that about to be on there? EO2. What does that mean then? What happens when you press that stop button? Oh. Oh. Oh, that sold it. Okay, fair enough. Oh. Hang on. Hold on. Uh, photon. You seem to be stopping. Is this alright? But nothing's happening on the bulb, no? No. Apparently I'm not going. Uh, I think we've got a little technical problem. Oh dear. Oh. Seems to... Hmm. Um, uh, folks, I'm, I don't think the stop button's working. Um, oh, oh, oh shit! <laughs> but it hasn't stopped it. Madness! It's still going. Shall I go again? How's that even possible? It seems to be going faster than what it should be. What are you doing? I'm... It's out of oh control. Oh dear. It's not stopping. Oh dear. Oh, you pissed it off. <laughs> oh, it's angry. Oh, dear. That's going for it, isn't it? I think it was so going for it. Oh, 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 oh. I think we should put it on the ultimate power supply. That one. I think we're going to need the extension lead. Not this tiny little thing, of course. This one. I wonder what that does. So, what you like at dancing then? Uh, You're a bit cool in the club, yeah? Oh, come on, I've got, I've got buster grooves, mate. <laughs> buster grooves. This is the. Oh. <laughs> Wait. That's a bit weird, isn't it? Wait. You feeling a bit wobbly? Never thought I could go backwards. That's interesting. <laughs> that throws you off a bit, that does, doesn't it? Yeah, I bet that's a proper one, that, isn't it? Wait. <laughs> Away I go! <laughs> I've got to have a go at that. Yeah, indeed. That's <laughs> <laughs> done, done it! That's, that's proper weird, isn't it? Don't expect it, do you? Oh, that's not too bad that way, is it? Going back, going reverse is oh. fine. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, fucking hell. <laughs> Are you ready? I think I'll, I'll turn around this way, anyway. Yeah. Hold up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is like being drunk, isn't it? It literally is. It's like walking over the pub, like, oh yeah, I feel a bit pissed. Get to the bad job. Oh, there you go. Uh, fucking, you know, that's be fucking chilli peppers all over the floor. <laughs> I think you've done a bit more exercise than I have today. I'm knackered, so I think we need to see where it fails. Can you see the voltage? Oh, we're at 70 volts. 80, 90, 100. Oh, 
on a 500 watts, well 450, 500, 600, and right it, hold it, I was impressed. I saw some sparks coming out the back of the motor. Oh, I'm gonna get that. Ah. So what's three, that? Three, three, thirty volts. Hey. And a kilowatt. Crikey. Oh, can you smell that? Oh. Is that the normal way, or is it that's back? What's that? That's normal. Right, let's leave it on that and we'll go for that. Yeah. We are going to go from naught to pop. Something left in it. Go Sounds good, keep it there. A bit more? Yeah. 
Say it. Say it. Oh, I think. Flames. Maxed out. This is definitely the end of that motor and it's very hot as I just discovered. That's the end of that commutator. It's probably one of the windings are shorted out there somewhere. Well it was good fun. It was very robust. Indeed. There's the permanent magnets. There's not much chance of us getting them out complete. but. They're quite nice, but it is no more. It's finished. That concludes today's video, ladies and gents. I hope you enjoyed it. Big thank you to Harry who come down and assisted me with that treadmill. He's uh, half my age and twice as fit, so he did a lot of hard work there, so I didn't have to. As we're on the subject of motors and motion, a huge thank you to Michael and the team at E-Force FEE Prague Formula for sending me some huge power thyristors. I will be using those in a future project. So huge thank you to Michael and the team for that. There is a link in the description if you want to see some proper electric vehicles, not like our ones that resemble cordless vacuum cleaners. These are proper electric racing vehicles. It's quite interesting. So link in the description for that and I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.